good evening again i'm back with another video i've been meaning to talk about this for a while and god reminded me from one of the last videos that i did um probably like two weeks ago he reminded me then to do this but y'all red bull energy drinks if you are still drinking them y'all that's one of the reasons why you're having certain side effects and health issues and no, i'm not just talking about like heart issues and stuff i'm talking about there is something spiritual about that drink um i know because i was drinking the mess out of them things whenever i was bound when i was bound i was drinking them a lot i was drinking them out of a wine glass um and probably like four of them a day or something like that it's like the stuff was trying to take me out of here but i eventually stopped drinking them but once i got unbound and um once i started back working and all that I don't know what made me go back to them, but I had tried them again. I think this was uh, last year, at the beginning of last year or something like that. It was a year ago. And they had a really huge effect on my cognitive function. They had an effect. I mean, they do kind of wake you up, but it also quenches your spirit. Like, it, it bogs your spirit down. I don't know what it is. It's something in that that's not good for the human body at all. Um, and not only affects the flesh, though, it affects the spirit, too, as well. Um, I know that it has some of the same effects as alcohol do. And it can also trigger certain responses within the body. Now, this is what I just know, okay? So, let's say that a person is trying to uh, rid themselves of drugs and alcohol and trying to stop smoking and all of that. Y'all know I've been stopped doing that. But... It's something in a Red Bull that will trigger that, um, that will trigger that taste for that again. It's something in it that actually causes sin too. Like it, it's deep with this drink, y'all. It's deep. Um, it causes the person to have hormonal imbalances. Let's say that you haven't been doing anything sexual. Now all of a sudden that you you having sexual urges that are really really strong. Um, that's what this drink does. It's something in this stuff that god don't want us partaking in just like i was saying um about a person that is trying to quit drugs and alcohol they mess around and drink one of those energy drinks a lot of times it'll cause them to start back smoking again you know i don't know <laughs> like i said it's something in it and um it has a, a drug type thing in it it's something that's in it that's addicted to as well in the form of other addic addictive substances I believe some of the same stuff that's in alcohol is in Red Bull energy drinks. Not only is it Red Bull though, I know that the Lord don't want us drinking monsters too, y'all. So if you're drinking them, you may need to look into that. I don't know about y'all, but it's certain stuff that I'm not allowed to partake in as far as um, God giving me my restrictions. It's certain drinks that I'm not allowed to drink, certain foods that I'm really not allowed to eat, except for every now and then because if I do, I break out and all of that and start feeling weird. And so energy drinks is just not on the market for me. And I, he don't even want me drinking them every now and then. So y'all, yeah, it's some in it, okay? So if you are drinking them, you might need to look into it and pay attention to your body. A lot of times when your body is like doing different stuff that you're not familiar with and you know you feel weird, you may, that's telling you that that's not for you. That's not something that you're supposed to be partaking in, guys. But yeah, I've been meaning to get this message out. Hope this helps somebody. And um, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell y'all that um, this was last year. Last year when I had bought a monster drink, a monster energy drink. I don't know why I even bought it, bought it because I really don't even need it. Because of the foods that I eat, it actually automatically gives me energy. So I think I just bought it for the taste, just to taste it or something. But it was this girl that bought it, so I bought one. And um, I had felt in my spirit, you don't need to be drinking that. You know, I, I kept feeling it strong. And I was being a little hard-headed. I took probably like, probably like three, four sips out of it, and I set my can down. And um, I kept feeling real strong that I didn't need to drink it. And so after that, um, a girl came through and knocked my energy drink over where I couldn't drink it and I was so I was like wow okay I get it I will not buy no more and I did I haven't bought any more ever since 
I haven't bought any more energy drinks ever since then. And I said, yep, that's what I was feeling in my spirit. And it just confirmed that I do not need this. Knocked it all the way over. I think it was like a, this much left after she knocked it over. And so I just threw it away, y'all. But yeah, thank you for listening. I will talk to you guys later. I love y'all. Bye.